My stream's being goofy. Just doing the drop frame shit. Fun. Nothing tickles the ovaries like that. Made me nervous. <coughs> nervous, I tell you. Welcome to the stream. Why do I smell popcorn? Oh shit, because I have food in the oven. Hang on. Hang on, I got a I got something to brag about in a minute. I just got this notification on Twitter. The top one. like a million people but still <laughs> I saw oh oh not following John because like um he started trending because my hero academia's promotional poster for the third movie has Deku doing this and they confirmed that that it was a tribute to Cena so I got I didn't I was like oh not following Cena and then I clicked follow him oh <laughs> I don't know if he saw that he read the bio with wrestler quick <laughs> like oh thank you So like he thought I was a mom, I'm so the baby. So like that that noise is so like you nothing has ever replicated that noise. So as soon as I heard it, I turned and I'm like, I watch the panda video. <laughs> That's like one of the first viral YouTube videos, I think. I said the first time I heard it, I'm like, oh they all go green to the mommy and I'm wearing it. He's like, That's the baby. That's <laughs> He fucking scared the mom more than anything. <laughs> so I was like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, yeah, I heard it. All right, I'm back. Oh, God, we're dropping frames again. What the... Is she fuck? Hang on. Did it just happen? Ooh. 25... Yeah, about five minutes ago. Fun! 
Well, it gets me excited than a stream, than a malfunctioning live stream, especially one on your birthday. Hell yeah. All right. Sorry about that. Oh my god, I'm so sick of pizza. I can't, it's all I have. Wait. <laughs> I'm so complicated, man. I am uh, annoying as fuck. Where? Oh, great. Now we're looking for earbuds. Early as fuck now. There we go. Now we're looking for the squishy part. Aha! I see. Do the fucking drill. Sorry for, um, strictly sly as of late. You know, the past two, two, three streams. But it's just like, it's, once I start playing sly, I just can't stop. I like, I have to finish this. Uh, I wasn't going to be all, oh, we're going to play this. Then we're going to play three. Then we're going to play four. Like, no, fuck that. We're going to at least finish two. So we can start three. Dude, I don't want to eat this. I'm hungry. Zach's join. Zach, you beautiful fecker. the love 46 people Jesus that's a lot of love also Pedro Pascal um, showed some love to uh, his sister I thought that was pretty cool uh, Zach thank you Oh my god, I'm not even drunk. What the fuck? Oh, okay, I know what that is, never mind. I don't know, for some reason I couldn't see these notifications on my, um... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um... On my phone. It would just load up, and then load up, like, the, the last ten. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Can I save that? Oh god, Facebook is so weird, isn't it? Oh, you bastard. Of course. Whoa! John, you can't say that. Uh, I love you. Thank you, though. Oh, my God! There's so many fucking birthday wishes. There's still more. Jesus. Am I friends with that many people? Hey. Oh my god, my old English teacher. Who that? Is that Zach? Hello, gamer. Howdy. 
Trying to catch. So my fault. Uh, what? Trying to fucking. I did, all these people are texting me happy birthday on Facebook, and for some reason I couldn't look at it earlier till now. So now I'm trying to care react every single fucking one. <laughs> all right on. Uh, my phone's at four percent, and I'm walking up to Pilot to meet Emma. So when I drop out, I drop out. But I'll talk to you till my phone dies. Okay, so you'll be on for literally two minutes. <laughs> hey, that's too much of content you didn't have, motherfucker. True. And then when I get home, if um, you're still streaming, I'll do my thing. I'll join. I'm not drinking tonight, and um, I don't have work in the morning, so I should be awake. Okay, cool. Last night I was going, I was about, to, I was falling into a coma towards the end. <laughs> Bro, I got stopped by a fucking cop on my way here. Oh yeah, how'd that go? <laughs> He's like, hey, sir, how's it going? Everything going okay? And I'm like, yeah, man, I'm just walking up here to surprise my girlfriend. Meanwhile, I'm so drunk I can't walk in a straight line. Oh, that's probably why. Did he ID you? No, no, he's just like, all right, you have a good night, man. You sure, make sure you're not a fucking hoodlum. Hello, Justin. <laughs> I am a hoodlum. <laughs> Welcome. Justin, join the voice chat if you want. I almost pissed on a church tonight. Why would you Which do I am glad now that I did not. Yeah, why would you do such blasphemous things? How am I missing two bottles? Clue bottles, not beer bottles, you fuck. I think we lost Zach. Hello. Hello, Justin. <laughs> we lost Zach and gained a Justin. It's okay. Yes. I still gotta get Brandon and Eddie to join um, the chat because they want to play Dead by Daylight with me. Oh shoot, I have Dead by Daylight. <clears throat> Pancho wants to play Monster Hunter with me, and I told him we would. Uh, for like, but like, pro oh shit, I'm getting shot at. The problem is, I'm what terrible at making plants sometimes. <laughs> what Monster Hunter game does he have? GU? Is that it? Generations Ultimate? Ah. Uh. What is it? What is that on? The Switch. Oh. And the okay. 3DS. Okay. Yeah, I have I have Monster Hunter World. Same. Um. Yeah. Yeah, I play that with my uh, friend Nikki. Ooh, it's a it's a fun one. All right. Maybe I could talk Nikki into seeing if you can join us on one of those games, cause I'm like I think I'm doing like finishing touches on the vanilla game. Either yeah. that or when I downloaded Ice... No, 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 okay. When I got Iceborne, I got that fucking grappling hook, okay. Yeah. Um, do you have it on PlayStation or PC? PlayStation. Oh, cool, okay. Yeah, because I, I... Yeah. I have it on PlayStation, and that's where, I, where I've progressed the most, but when it was on, like, a... What? That was Zach leaving, I think. Oh, okay. Whenever I was on a, um... Whenever it was on like a Steam sale, I was like, eh, you know, I'll pick it up for the PC too. And it didn't really go very far. <laughs> what do you mean? You, you couldn't afford it or or <laughs> PC couldn't run it? Uh, no, it could. It's just like the PC controls were, I don't know, I wasn't used to them. It's, there's mm -hmm. a beautiful thing called a gamepad, Justin. <laughs> Alright, give me a second, buddy. I, I need to... I have some things to get in order still. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, gamepads are great. Yeah. In fact, I get shit from my uh, PC friends for it, because nine times out of ten I will use a gamepad. <clears throat> Excuse me while I just look up a uh, gamepad. <laughs> it, it could be a 360 controller, or a Xbox One controller. Oh, okay. I, I think you could do your PS4 controller, too. Probably. Because, like, well, I mean, it, the PS4 controller works when I play uh, PS Now on PC, but... Uh, other than that... <clears throat> though, usually I'll still use my Xbox controller even when I'm playing PS Now. <laughs> <laughs> which yeah, I, my... Which I love it yells at you, going, you should use this, and I'm like, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my solution was, um... I got, like, an... HDMI switcher thing yeah. so that I can have my PlayStation because I have two monitors. I can use yeah. 
like my PlayStation and PC plugged into one, and I think my Switch is also plugged into it as well. Yeah. And I can just use this remote to to change which HDMI output is going through. Yeah, <clears throat> I got the same thing because um, uh, the PS4, unless you turn off HDCP, won't for some reason um, the Elgato just won't run it. Yeah. So, so like, uh, I got a splitter, pretty much, uh, pretty much. Um, I forgot how it works, but using that uh, HDMI splitter, bear. Um, using that HDMI splitter, fucking, uh, lets me run it without having to disable it. That and the PS3, you couldn't, you couldn't run the PS3 at all, because there's, there was no disable HDCP option. Which, yeah, which suck, which sucks, which is probably, which was probably another reason why so many streamers and YouTubers at the time played on 360. That would make sense. Yeah, yeah I have this, uh, this, this like USB thing yeah. that lets me video capture. Oh no um, shit! I got, I got it for like twenty bucks on Amazon. However, the only problem I have with it is that it it, it only video captures. It doesn't bring through the sound. Oh and like, god. The video the video's not that bad, but it's just there's there's no game sound. There's no sound. <laughs> I'd suggest the Elgato for sure. It's like yeah. I mean, I'm sure you could get it for cheap used on eBay or some shit. But like cheap is probably still gonna be like eighty bucks. Oh definitely. Yeah. So what the hell did you do today? You weren't at camp. Hey man, I work doubles like every day. Oh yeah. I actually I had to, I got pickup hours myself. <laughs> I, I had to to take a day to just like get my at home stuff in order because like my room's a mess. I haven't been able to do anything because <laughs> right. I've just because what was it? It was like Friday I worked eight hours at one job and then four hours at the other and then Saturday I worked like five hours and then I went straight to wrestling. And then Sunday I worked another double, and then today I worked, or yesterday I worked another double, and it was just like, yeah. All work and no play. Exactly. Um, but coming up in, like, March or something, I'm going to be starting up college again. Just, like, community college. So I'm probably not going to be doing two jobs anymore, because that would, uh, I'd probably die. Ooh, I, I need that. Ooh. Yeah. Silent obliteration. Yeah, that's pretty much, uh, I can knock him out, I can knock out a guy without it causing sound. Oh, that's good. Because usually when you knock out an asshole, you, you have to run, because, like, if they're around someone, someone's going to hear you smashing their face in. Yeah. The, uh, you see, the closest thing that I've played to Sly Cooper... Is I, I remember actually having the game, but I, I never really got around to playing to it. But uh, I did have the Fairly Odd Parents game, and and there's a stealth mission that it's it's hey the t the Fairly Odd Parents game on the GameCube is a classic. It it is phenomenal. Are you being serious or like? Cause like I've never played it. You, there there's always those um, gem third party games sometimes. I, I, I remember thoroughly enjoying it, but I don't know how well it's actually <laughs> held up. Right, because you were a kid at the time. Yeah. What was it? You know a third party game that was fucking great? King Kong. Peter Jackson's King Kong. <laughs> that game is fucking awesome. <laughs> I fucking okay. hear a bottle. Where is it? Or I think I oh, do. No. Yeah, it was uh, it was the Fairly Odd Parents breaking the rules. Um, and it's basically they they ripped the fairly odd parents rule book, and and they they had to like get all the pages back or something. Uh, okay. Well, hey, that's uh that's the fucking plot of uh, Sly Sly One. <laughs> <laughs> it is though. <laughs> they can see where they got their ideas from. <laughs> right. Fucking um. All right, I'm just literally fucking around trying to find bottles. I'm just gonna go do the mission. All right. Uh, yeah, it came out in uh, 2003 and was developed by Blitz Games and published by THQ. That's not bad then, THQ. I mean, yeah, it was published by them. They didn't do it, so that 
could mean dick all, but... It, yeah, that's true. Oh, speaking of weird sh Speaking of things that mean dick all, I found out, uh, I got a notification on Twitter today, and apparently John Cena now follows me. <laughs> what? Well, and then I looked, he follows like 200,000 fucking people on Twitter. <laughs> ah, okay. So, uh, I don't know, he must have read my bio and go, wrestler, follow. <laughs> wrestler? I, I, I dig it. Um... Oh, Man. okay. I know what he meant. Ha. Huh. Took me a sec, like, wait a minute, what? What does he mean by that? Fuck. Man, GameCube days were... were the days. Oh, hell yeah. I was laughing because uh, I played Ed and Eddie, The Misadventures, <clears throat> on here for the PS2. Yeah. First time I ever played that game was on the um, GameCube, and I was like, Jesus Christ, this game runs better on the GameCube than the PS2. <laughs> yeah, I had, I had like, The Sims on GameCube, which I gotta tell you, god-awful controls. Um, the Sims is not meant for, like, console. It just it isn't. For console. Yeah, I, I can believe that. It's just so because it, it's such like a, a a point and click game, and I don't think it's the easiest to point and click with a oh, controller. Oh yeah, you wouldn't like Jurassic World Evolution then on the console. <laughs> you probably want that on PC. Yeah, um, Luigi's Mansion was was always a classic. I thought you were about to say Luigi's Mansion was the best point and click. <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I've Dude, never played Luigi's the game, Mansion but I've was... seen enough of it to know that's not a point and click. <laughs> It's every game is bo basically a point and click. In a way, right? you just point the controller at the console. Well, wait, they didn't have infrared shit back in the day. I mean, they did, but it sucked. Oh god. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Zone. Ah, fuck me! That didn't work. Oh, here they all come. He just shot his friend. <laughs> He's still shooting his friend. Oh my god, he killed his friend. Awesome. <laughs> They're just shooting each other. It's awesome. One down. There we go. Oh. Well, I need to clear past the bottles. Or hey, once you know, there's the lung. I'll take that. The lung. Yes. Ah. What? Oh, oh Sora, welcome. Uh, what else did I play on GameCube? Resident Evil? I did not. Mm. Uh, okay, guys, it was- it was always... Time to break into Iron Horse either Luigi's Mansion, um, Awful Sims, uh, Fairly Odd Parents, or like, I had the Spongebob game, Battle for Bikini Bottom. Yeah. Which that actually got, um, like just re for remade. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, that was like back yeah. in the summer. Which I I also heard it's it's literally only the graphics that like got improved. Yeah, it was a, it's a remake remaster. Yeah, it was. Uh, I I there were a lot of people that were like expecting like other things, and it's like well. I don't really know what you're expecting, but... Destroy all humans, um, same way. It's, uh, yeah. like Green Master. Well, it's because games like, um... Resident Evil 2 Remake... have put this idea in people's heads that, um... Oh, it's a remake, so therefore it's gonna be totally new. But, I mean, not necessarily. Yeah, no. I, I remember playing Gale of Darkness, like, once, because I didn't own it, but... Uh, a family member of mine owned it, like cousin or something. Yeah. Gale of Darkness seemed really cool, though. 
Um, Thank you, Sora, for the birthday wish. And uh, I've only played one GameCube game in my life. The game is Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. I had PS2 growing up. Yeah, I did too. I didn't get a GameCube till fuck, I was an adult by the time I got a GameCube. <laughs> like, a uh, guy was having a yard sale, and I, and I bought it. I got it for cheap. Like, I got that and a bunch of games for, like, 40 bucks, 20 bucks. Oh, yeah. I think it was 20 bucks, actually, which is a huge steal. <laughs> Cause I was right, you know, you know what? Okay, I had forty dollars in my pocket, and I was ready to offer. I was ready to. That was as high as we we're gonna go. But I, I, of course, I watch Pawn Stars. I know how this works. Um, so I offered twenty. I love they all. They sat and thought. They start talking to each other. Like, yeah, fuck it. Yeah, it's yours. And I, 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 I left with a fucking. I'm like, hell yeah, man. <laughs> I forgot which games were. I think it was like Paper Mario. Oh, Paper, Paper Mario is, like, that was one another one that I played a bunch. Yeah, it was like Paper Mario, I think it's The Sims 2 Pets, I think a Lord of the Rings game, uh, Snowboard, I think Snowboarding at SSX. Oh, like... Oh, there the, you are, you bastard! Yeah. SSX Tricky or something like that? Something like that, yeah. Which... I wanted to stream that because it is actually a pretty fun game. The problem is I don't want to stream it without the music, but of course mm -hmm. it's you gotta love that. Um, I have a floating moose. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. Oh no, okay, he's on a platform. <laughs> the platform just didn't render all the way. <laughs> <laughs> I also played Animal Crossing once. I wish I owned SSX Tricky as a kid. No shit. Uh, uh, you s somebody said something that triggered a memory, and now I can't remember. There's a question I was gonna ask you, I feel like. Oh! Um, I don't think this was the question, but you ever played Gale of Darkness? Like, what, what is this about? Or have you ever seen it? Think like, like, Pokemon, but almost like, I wouldn't say open world, but it's more of like a a map that you can explore. Okay. Oh, what, like this, like yeah. what you're doing right now. Yeah, but it's Pokemon. like a small open world. Um, I don't know the story, but I know there's like shadow Pokemon that are like corrupted or something. And... Evil. <laughs> Evil. Bitch. It's uh, it's regarded as one of the like one of the best non-main series games. Oh, one of the best spin-off games. Yeah, because, like, I looked it up on eBay to see, hey, I wonder how much copy is. I think people want, like, $80 for the damn thing. I'm like, oh, God. Is it in here? Ooh, bear. I played... I played a ton of Harvest Moon on on the Wii. What is that game about? Because I got... I, I It was suggested to be on the... PS3 store. Um, at, I I know it's gone through a lot of iterations. Like, I from what I've heard, like every two games is like different than the previous two games. Also and like so, Legend of Zelda. Yeah, but the one that I played, uh, Tree of Tranquility. Um, you know, you you get your house and you like farm. Have you ever played like Stardew Valley? Yeah. Like, think about, like, farming and selling stuff like that, but, like, 3D, right? Mm. Not 2D. Um, and then, yeah, and then you can, like, romance some of the villagers. Um, you can marry them and have a kid, and when the kid grows up, um, your character can die, and yes. you can con continue the farm through the kid. Spooky. Um, yeah, but, like... There's a whole, like, story about, like, saving the, like, Private spirit room. of nature. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and, and yeah, it, it's honestly, it was a really good game. I always enjoyed it. Stardew's a good comparison. Harvest Moon's kind of like Animal Crossing. Had Splinter Cell, one of the Gran Turismo, also owned Pac-Man Fever. I hear, I, everyone, I, I got a couple friends that'd be like, oh god, you ever played Pac-Man Fever? I'm like, no, and they're like, oh, you should, it's a really fun, isn't it like a party game? Like, uh, I think it's like Super Mario Party or whatever the fuck. Oh god, I almost got ran over by a train. 
Almost. We got ran over by a train. Uh, <clears throat> how's the song go? Sorry, I'm not got run over by a reindeer. No, I'm thinking of uh, Pepper by the Butthole Surfers. <laughs> I don't know if you ever heard, heard them, but they're mm -hmm. fucking awesome. They were, I considered that song t as one of my themes. Or like, as what it, it was like, there's like three songs I finally was able to narrow down for like theme songs. It was uh, two Butthole Surfer songs and uh, <laughs> the song I'm coming out to now, which is... Uh, uh, my name is Mud, but Primus, but, yeah. Figure stick with the weird, weird shit, like Primus. <laughs> Primus, yeah. or Butthole Surfers. <laughs> I would say Tool, but my brother would get pissed if I came out to Tool, because, um, Tool's one of those bands that are like, we don't want our music in any, like, movies or commercials yeah. and shit, so, like, I feel like I'd respect my brother, I won't do that. Yeah. No, Tool would be. S I, I listening to Tool songs. You know how awesome those fucking songs would be, like a wrestling music video. <laughs> Jeez. Or somebody even coming out to the damn thing. Yeah. Is this PS2 version? No, this is actually the PS3 version. We were gonna play the PS2 version until I realized, oh my god, this game is dark as fuck. So I had to switch because <laughs> boy, was it not stream friendly to look at. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. So I just fucking got the PS3 remaster, HD remaster. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I still have my Wii. I think it still works. Um, But I actually, I'm kind of debating buying Harvest Moon <laughs> Tranquility. That's I never finished the game because as a child, um, one of the, like, the final missions, you have to catch... A, a fish. Yeah. And the fishing mechanics weren't awful, but they were kind of bad. Were they Sonic and... Adventures DX bad? No, I, I wouldn't say that. Um, but it was kind of garbage because the fish could only be found at like a certain hour of the day of the day in oh, the yeah. game. The, the game has like a day and night cycle, and it could only be found in like one hour of the day. And it was like, and it was like a one in like one hundred thousand, some crazy like rarity. And it was, it was so dumb. And so I spent like, like days trying to get it, and I just couldn't. Oh god! And then I gave up. I love. I looked into the uh, odds of finding a shiny Pokemon in main series games. Oh yeah. It's, I it's didn't realize fine. they were that rare because I figured there'd be people that would like, oh yeah, I got the shiny thing, shiny this, and like, no, I literally talked to people. They could, they could count on one hand what shiny Pokemon they were able to catch. I mean, I did a lot of. Sh they they make methods that make it easier. Oh yeah, cheats. The Game Shark. I remember that. No, no, they like, um, if you finish the Pokedex, you get a shiny charm, which increases your odds. Yeah. And then there's like, there's chaining that you could do where if you like encounter the same Pokemon like over and over again, it slowly increases your odds. So I mean, mm, at, at yeah. some point you can increase it to like, you know, 1 in 800, 1 in like 2000 or something like that. Yeah, cause um, Giants I was ever able to find were um, it was like a golden graveler. Mm -hmm. And like a blue Medichan. Uh, and. It was either Diamond. I think it was Diamond. Uh, cause, but at the same time, if you go in a certain cave, you see a shit, a million and two Gravelers. And then if you uh, go up in the, I, in the fucking mountains, there's a million and two Medichans. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes, go that way. Thank you. The Zubats, though. Yeah, I feel like I've caught a shiny Zubat before. Yeah, now that you, oh fuck me. Yeah, now that you mentioned that, I I could believe that then. Cause yeah, it was always common ass Pokemon. Cause like, someone said like the odds of catching like a, a shiny legendary are very slim too. Cause like, the only way to get that is like you would have to constantly save. So you'd save, and then restart it. 
restart your game until it's shiny, which you could be there for hours doing that. Because the odds are so slim. <laughs> yeah, I think... I think normally they're like 1 in 8,000. Mm. Yeah. Um, in recent games, though, I think as of like Gen 7 or something, yeah. ah. it was brought down to like 1 in 4,000. It's, it's a bit easier. Oh, I love, um, I think my biggest brag in Pokemon. I caught a Giratina with a Pokeball. A basic bitch vanilla Pokeball. <laughs> my like, man. he was literally at one. One HP. And I, I just had a shit ton of Pokeballs and, like, um, all these other special Pokeballs. I'm like, ah, fuck it. <laughs> sure as shit. So, it caught it. So, so like, whenever, um, I would play with my friends, um, whenever I play with my friends, I would, uh, and I would send out Giratina, they'd be like, wait a minute, did he just come out of a Pokeball? <laughs> so, a, a Pokeball? Like, wait a minute, hold on now. Hold on. <laughs> What's your take on Master Balls? Like, do you, like, instantly use them on the first Legendary, or do you hold on to them? I... I haven't even, like... Recently, I, I just don't use the Master Ball. You see, I... I'm a fan of, like... Earning it? N no, I like to... It's always kind of nice to, like, color code, right? Okay. So, like, if you get, like, a red Pokemon, you're gonna use a Pokeball. You know? Because really? it's red. Yeah. Um, or, like, th ha have you ever seen, like, I, don't, I can't remember if it's Latios or Latias, um, but it's, like, red and white. Mm -hmm. and so, obviously, why wouldn't you use red and white, you know? Cheap. Thinking outside the box. I think it's Latias, which I remember almost getting in trouble in school for saying Latias. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You remember the action replay Darkrai Cheat? Yeah, you know, I never understood, or, um, I remember I got into it with somebody I was seeing at the time who was a Pokemon expert, pretty much. And, um, he knew Darkrai was in the game, but he didn't know how to get him. Mm -hmm. And I told him, oh yeah, you just, ah, fuck, I'm, I guess I'm being distracted. Um, I told him how to do it, he wouldn't believe me. Finally, we looked it up. And, yeah, it was, because I remember in school, we were trying to figure out, I was asking around, like, hey, how do you, how do you open this door? Because it wouldn't be just, me being, as much video games as I played at the time, I knew something was up. It wouldn't just be, it wouldn't just say the door is t sealed shut, where the fuck, for no reason. So, like, they said, oh, yeah, you gotta get this cheat, this walkthrough walls cheat to go in. I'm like, oh. Yeah. And then, um. Sure shit. And then when I showed him that, he's like, well, what the fuck? How's that fair? <laughs> I was just like, I don't know what to tell you. Remember when yeah, GameStop I... would just give you free Pokemon? Like, legendaries? Yeah. That was awesome. I, I will say, my biggest accomplishment was, um, I, I have an entire living dex. So I have one of every Pokemon. There um, you go. Yeah. And that, that took me a, a good minute. That was some fancy flying, little friend. Whatever you say, I love the strength of Murray being able to use a fucking pump car by himself. <laughs> He's just that strong, man. He's that strange. Strange. The power. It knocks him out? I thought it just distracted him. Oh yeah. Um What's a what's in there's also a um there was a game on the Wii that was like yeah. Imagine like a like a board game, but like RPG. Okay. Um, 
And I, I remember having a lot of fun with it. Yeah. So I tried looking it up and uh, I, I saw like the reviews for the game and everyone was, was, was pissed because they have like a feature in the game where the person in last place can like get an insane power up. Yeah. And it, and it was quite literally an insane power up that <laughs> that just broke the game. <laughs> Like, it was the type of thing where, like, you'd almost automatically win 100%. <laughs> and, and so I saw a lot of bad reviews. I, I can't think of the name anymore. I had it. But I used to really enjoy it. It was... It was God, the Wii was... So many good games. Wine! It's actually one of my favorite boss fights, it's just annoying. <clears throat> well, it's because I suck at games. <laughs> <laughs> dang, how are you gonna miss that bomb? Yeah, dang. I swear they go faster after a while, though, so you're like, fuck. Like, th like that? Fuck you! <laughs> Cheap ass. Oh yeah, Hawlush is a cool Pokemon. Finally, we get a, a a wrestler Pokemon. Oh my God, you know that? F <laughs> you know that? You know those two Pokemon in the Karate Gis? <laughs> yeah. I shared. Uh, Sock. I was Sock laughing because the red one looks like Double Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Posture oh at all. God. Oh my god. <laughs> say double zero kind of slouches. I actually re really enjoyed Gen 6. Gen 6 was the was the game that got me back into Pokemon. Because, like, I played Gen 4. Yeah. And then when Gen 5 came out, I was just like, yeah, I'm not feeling it. Wasn't Gen 5 black and white? Yeah, I think I was just like... Part of me was just like I wasn't enjoying Pokemon as much in general. Mm -hmm. but, but it was also the fact that, like... They introduced so much with Gen 5, and I was just like, oh my goodness. Uh, but then Gen 6, I think, probably one of my favorite games. I probably have put the most time into the Gen 3 remakes, which are technically Gen 6. Um, but those were top-notch. And X and Y were great. What you, what you eating there? The gang and I had pulled off something I shouldn't be. We'd successfully robbed all of oh my goodness. Horse trains, and we were walking away with three. Count them three clockwork. Don't points. worry, I'd bonus, do it too. That's all I'm having, though. To say, mm -hmm. I, didn't, with our I was hungry, but I wasn't starving. Can't say the same for Carmelita. Once again, the fucking police woman had to run from the cops. Which was fun at first. So at least I can have the leftovers for breakfast because I usually have giant breakfast. What if they replace Yeah, my I usually have a pretty big breakfast. My tail. She's a big part of why I I wouldn't say it's balanced, but it's a big breakfast. Sooner or later, I'm going to have to figure out a way to clear her name some way other than turning myself in. Um I will get sword and shield at some point. Jen, I missed out with three. Yeah, I missed out on three too, and then I fucking three was... What's three that? Three was awesome. I fucking got um I think I've told you about this before. I got this game called Moemon. Canada. It's a fucking it's a hack. Isn't it, isn't it all the all the Pokemon are just cute anime girls? Pretty much, yeah. One night they yeah. brighter than ever, and the next is hilarious. <laughs> I, I would always, I'd always play a little bit of it, and I'm just like, eh, I don't want to play this anymore. And then I'll just restart it, and I'm like, eh, I don't want to play this anymore. By like second gym later. Yeah. Tracking the source of the disturbance was easy by simply following the lights. Like Gen 3 remakes, but yeah, never remember. There's remakes of Hoenn? Yeah, it's uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Pathivius Raccoonus makes. They came out after X and Y. Slicing through plates of steel. 
That's right, because like someone was someone was laughing about the fucking zigzagoon chasing the scientist. It goes, it, 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 it looked ridiculous in 2D. Now it's now look, it's even more in 3D. The world just to make space for another strip mall. Totally forgot about that. That's hilarious. You know, for for you, have you ever seen some of the like the stuff in Pokemon though that's like dark, like uh, like Lavender Town dark and like spooky shit. Yeah, or like there's even like Pokédex entries that are just like <laughs> really messed up. Um, which I mean, you know, you know the Pokédex entry for Drifloon. Do you know which Pokemon that is? Yeah, wasn't it some creepy? Um, you know, it it'll actually uh, drift around like kids and wait for a kid to grab it, and then it'll fly away and never return. <laughs> oh shit! That's awesome. <laughs> it it kidnaps kids. <laughs> um, that's what you want. Something creepy was I was playing. Um, I was playing. Uh, what, what what's the one? I was playing sword. And I found that little girl in that one town, and she said, can Oh, yeah. Can you deliver this letter to, to this guy? And it's an old ass letter. And sure enough, it's a little girl, but uh, old ass man. I'm like, Huh. <laughs> and then you go up to the fucking kid in the same house who's staring at a corner, and I forgot what he said. He said, uh, I think he was either laughing or something, or said, Hey, don't interrupt our conversation. And I'm like, Who the fuck? <laughs> This is not something I need to be looking at drunk at 3 a.m. <laughs> on Twitch. I feel like if I wasn't such a completionist in, in, uh, for Sly games, I would, like, have this game done by now, but I'm like, but I need Clue Bottle. Yeah. Because it's, like, it's, cause it's like fucking easy. Of course I do it. Time trial is in the first game. Fuck you. I'm not doing that. I'm slow in general. Even you know that. <laughs> You've seen me, Russell. <laughs> a little on the sluggish slide, can't can't lie to you. <laughs> God, I was watching my match back with Poncho. I'm just like, oh. It was oh. fine. It, it was fine, but damn, I gotta work on some stuff. Yeah. Aside from freezing up at the end, but <laughs> I'm talking about other like little stuff. I'm like, ooh. <laughs> yeah, I I get that. <laughs> Uh, you wanna you wanna hear the um, the Pokedex entry for Snubble from the Fire Red games? Sure. Um, Wrong. it has an active, playful nature. Many women like to frolic with it because because of its affectionate ways. Huh. It's, it seems a little weird. Um. Sexual? Why are you alluding to? It, it sounds kind. of... <laughs> I don't know. That's they have a they have these like really dis like bad like images next to the, next to the entries that kind of just make it worse. Um. Or like, have you ever seen the quote? I forget which game it's from. I think it's from Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. But there's like one of the the swimmer girls in the ocean. Who's wearing a bikini? Yeah. And and she's like, I bet you're wondering where I put my uh, my pokeballs while I'm out here swimming in the ocean. And then she's like, Teehee, women's secret. Oh. <laughs> Lovely. Very very great. Smelly. Smelly pokeball. <laughs> uh, I don't want I don't want to touch the pokeball anymore. <laughs> I thought you were to say I don't want to touch that. <laughs> <laughs> I, there's a hook there, then you paraglide, but alright. Oh! I oh, mean. No! I mean, the, the Pokedex entry for Palisand is buried beneath the castle are oh, masses of dried up bones from whose vitality is, it has drained. Did you just realize what I said and start laughing? 
<laughs> I I only heard part of what you said. <laughs> you said what are you like Palestine or whatever the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I said pocket sand. <laughs> oh my god. God, I always I'm not used to that yet. I'm used to him just slamming that ass on the fucking concrete. No, he's he does the fucking vortex now. You think I fucked it up? Like no. You know that you know that uh, adorable Pokemon Spoink. Spoink. Ah, oh, the name sounds so familiar. It's like the pig with the orb on its head. Oh yeah, Spoink. Okay. Yeah. Um. Did you know that if it stops bouncing, it dies? I've heard that. Kind of like Charmander, his tail gunk. He can't let his tail go out. Yeah. And someone made a very, very fucking upsetting fan art of a dead Charmander underwater. No. <laughs> I'm like, great. I love when people make upsetting stuff like that. <laughs> That's just the best. Another one, another favorite upsetting one. Fucking, uh... Those two Doberman, what were they called? The two dogs? Like, the, not two, but like, there's this, th that dog with like horns, they look like a hellhound. Uh, Houndoom? Houndoom, yeah, uh, girl getting mauled by Houndooms. Uh, that's, uh, that's concrete, baby. <laughs> Fuck me, man. <laughs> Don't need that in my life. Fucking deviant art, you bitch. Thank you. How the fuck do I get over here? Oh, don't make me have to climb that thing to fucking paraglide over there. I think it's gonna make me do it. You know, do you know the Pokemon Phantom? Phantom. Ah, uh, sounds familiar. It's it's like a ghost log boy. Yep. Um, it's Pokedex entry is that these Pokemon are stumps possessed by the spirit of children who died in the forest. Their cries sound like eerie screams from Pokemon Sun. Love it. I I just I just like how how okay Pokemon is with children dying and right <laughs> becoming Pokemon. Especially if you believe the uh... oh I don't have this ability oh I do never mind I, for I forgot you can. Uh... He's got this ability where like his canes can come apart and you can uh, climb ice. Ooh. But like it doesn't come in until this level. Yeah. Which I figured I had to do the mission first to do it. Nope. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, you should have seen Vine today. He has a fucking goatee. Oh, I I saw him post it on his Instagram. Oh uh, yeah, he he said uh, I called him uh, Evil Vine because uh. There's that one South Park episode where, like, everyone from the evil dimension had, uh, had goatees. Oh. <laughs> of course, Eric, Eric's, Eric's was, uh, the nicest fucking kid. <laughs> so, but yeah, that, that's what the goatee looked like. I couldn't stop staring at him. He even said, stop fucking staring at me. Sorry about that. Because got Moondog staring at me. <laughs> I can't help it. It's, it's weird. <laughs> I never seen him with it's such just, facial hair. It's just not right. <laughs> I've seen the Italian fro before, like in pictures and shit. And then, of course, he had—I think he still has it, actually. I'm sure, he's gonna be hitting me up to cut his hair. So, possibly. It's possible. 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 Yeah, let's go. Oh, never mind. She saw the other cat and said, fuck you. And stay. Get out of here. Yeah, she doesn't like the other cat. Uh, my brother's cat. Um. What's the... Are there any games that you've 100%ed? Uh, like... this one. Oh. It's probably sad, but I feel like this one is the only one. <laughs> Cause like I, I like I don't mind 100%ing most things, but like plat, like I don't think I've ever gotten a platinum trophy mm -hmm. other than for like Sly 2. Yeah, I uh, I'm trying to think. 
what I possibly have 100%ed. The only one that comes to mind is Slime Rancher. I did that one. Uh, I think that that's... At, at, at a point, I 100%ed Minecraft, but they, you know, it constantly updates, so... Are you asshole? Stop fighting the bear so I can take its picture. <laughs> Damn it. Now you got it all turned around. This bear uh, is blind, so like I can like literally walk in front of it and it not notice me. I, I, I love how like I will not think of shit like that in like years and then I'll and then I'll look at it and go, Oh yeah, that bear's blind. Oh yeah, I remember that bear. What the fuck? I thought he couldn't see me. He's blind. <laughs> Maybe I'm mixing him up with another bear, but I know there's a fucking bear mission where he, like, he's blind. You just can't run around him. But like, that's how you attract him is you just make a shit ton of noise, and then you hope hmm. he smashes like a computer or some shit. <laughs> what do I need to take a picture of? The boat itself. This fucking outhouse. Oh shit. Damn it, Sly, you and your inability to swim. Damn it, Sly. Fucking. What a fact, raccoons can swim. <laughs> they like do a little doggy paddle. That's nice. Um. Ooh. I can't wait until Friday. Oh, yeah? Is it payday? It is, but it, it's also one division day, so. Yeah, I gotta. I've heard some wild it shit. Is, I need to watch it. Is, it. it is amazing. I heard someone. I love like when the first two episodes came out. Uh, a friend of mine was asking if I've seen it, any of it. I said no, no, I haven't. And he goes, "It reminds me of Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared." And <laughs> after he said that, he sold me. I'm like, "What the fuck does that mean?" <laughs> I may have to watch it now, cause that fucking that that video is fucked up. Those videos. I, I mean, I guess in a sense, cause it's like a, uh, it's yep. like everything's fine. Yeah, it's then, like a facade. And then, and then something happens, and it's like what? And then everything's fine again. Uh, but it, it is really good. have have you kept away from spoilers or, or do you know pretty much what... yeah i haven't heard one single spoiler which shocks the hell out of me because okay, like okay. god forbid i want to watch uh a wrestling show without being spoiled until i literally go on twitter oh my god he won the match ah oh, fuck <laughs> thanks <laughs> thanks guys uh, but like when it comes to tv shows i don't i don't see anything ever yeah hmm the only non-wrestling spoiler I got was Tony Stark dying in, uh, whatchamacallit, Infinity War. What? I didn't know that. Yeah, he's fucking dead, Justin! And I'm sure the, no. I'm sure the day when I finally watch Infinity War, I'm probably gonna cry like a bitch. Oh, goodness. You haven't seen Infinity War? No. I hear it's so no. good, too. Such a horror for not seeing it. Brand Brandon's, like... That's the movie that made me stop watching Marvel, and I'm like, why? I mean, it's a good fucking finale for. Yeah, he a, well he, yeah. he's uh he's not at all a fan of of Captain Marvel. <laughs> That's it. I've and, heard and, that shit too. Was it people were and, shit on Captain Marvel? Said it was terrible. I mean, it's just like I guess I wouldn't say she's a bad character, but it's like. She had a movie, like, right before Endgame, and was just kind of, like, thrown in there, and then and then she, like, gets to be a part of Endgame and, and do a bunch of stuff, and it's like, well, we saw, we saw no growth. <laughs> like, they didn't, like, give any time to really care about the character, I guess. Yeah, I've heard My... about that. <clears throat> and plus, people just kind of dislike Brie Larson, but, you know. Brie Larson. But which one was Brie Larson again? Um. Uh, and what were, uh, I, let me re-ask that. What shit has Brie Larson been in? 
Um, she was in Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. Uh, if you... What did she play? Um, Scott's ex-girlfriend. Oh, the Asian one? No, the the other ex. The, the blonde one. I haven't seen that movie anymore. I'm terrible at shit, aren't I? Um, As I fall. What has Brie Larson been in? Googling Brie Larson in general may have also helped, but... <laughs> <laughs> um, Alright, buddy. Hey, now. Um, she was in Kong Skull Island. Oh, um, I know what you're like, talking about. As like the camera girl, yeah, or whatever she was. Which is awesome because she she also co-starred with Tom Hiddleston. <laughs> yeah. Kong Skull Island awesome. isn't that bad of a movie. I can't no. lie. So the Godzilla ones are fucking awful, but the Skull Island. Yeah, Dude, good. what about King Kong vs Godzilla? Oh, that one I'm hyped for, even though it's probably gonna be terrible. But because <laughs> nothing you... nothing says. Hey, Godzilla film, and I want to see monsters smashing like watching a family fall apart in a divorce. Oh yeah, that just tickles my nipples uh, when yeah. seeing a Godzilla film. So you know what I never really thought of? Um, Penis. I I you know I I kind of don't think it. Yeah, that's that's probably fair. Um, that's kind of not what's on my mind, but. <laughs> I love you gave I, a huge explanation for that. <laughs> I I never thought, because cause you know Scarlet Witch is played by Elizabeth Ol Olsen? Yeah. Um, I, I recently heard in a YouTube video that she's related to the Olsen twins. No shit! And, and like, now I now I can see it, but I, for, for the longest time, I, I had no clue. What but, is she, a cousin or a sister? Or... I think sister. No shit. She's, she's Younger, like an older. older? Um, older, I believe. Yeah, I keep Hold forgetting on. the Olsen twins are not even that old. They're only like in their thirties. They um, look in their fifties, but. <laughs> okay, no, she's she's younger. Okay. okay, yeah. Now that I think about it, I'm like older. Who, where the hell were they hiding her? <laughs> Yeah, no, she's she's three years younger. Um, How old is she? Thirty-one, and okay. the Olsons are thirty-four. Thirty-four, Jesus! Cause when they were older, and they look like they're in their fifties. <laughs> I yeah. forgot what happened. Uh, my dad told me why they were, why they kind of aged like fucking vegetables in the fridge. <laughs> like garbage. I think it was like something like. I don't know, were they into drugs, partying? Like Probably that. drugs, I would imagine. I feel like I remember some stories about that. Things you go through as a child actor. <laughs> Fuck you! Not you, fucking this game. There we go. Just looking at that spinner makes me yeah. Do yeah, you made me take like four goddamn pictures of it. How do you think I feel, Bentley? In my ass. That's right. The door is blocked by a fucking chair. You know, the thing that you could, if you smash the door hard enough, you could probably knock over. No, what do you mean? That just wouldn't make any sense. It's just like this old wooden chair. <laughs> that, that'll buy you time, but eventually they're gonna fucking smash right through. Oh, yeah. Was I not supposed to leave yet? Fuck. Excuse me. Hush me in my whore mouth. Swearing's not allowed. Fuck. Nope. I didn't know that. You can't. You can't say that, man. John, you got it in you. Those lumberjack games need some more competition, eh? What would attract the participants? I'll post the clockwork talons as a trophy. Mm. That should bring in the competition. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, I'm gonna win just like every God, I love the music in, this, in these two levels. <clears throat> I always love old southern, like, twangy, like, 
instruments like down, bow, 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 bow. Which is hilarious because I'm not really a country music fan. <laughs> Just can't, I, can't do it. I I had my my short likeness of it, but as of late, it hasn't really been my thing. Like I can listen to southern rock, country rock, where the fuck. But like, guide was like fucking um. What? Well, oh my god, who who are those guys that got with Nelly? They made that song. They they, they, they were on Raw to perform it. I couldn't tell you. Yeah, the fucking names. Yeah, they they them particularly I didn't wasn't too fond of. However, the location of the devices. Then in comes uh Lil Nas X with a uh. Hey, fuck it. Let's let's, let's do a new spin on country. Add some hip hop to it. Did didn't he? Um, hold on. Before I say this, I gotta research. Happy birthday. Thank you, Gems. Apparently the fucking, uh, was it that, uh, Take My Horse song? Apparently that, uh, the, in the fucking instrument to it is a Trent Reznor fucking song. Or Trent Reznor EP that they had. So technically, when they got fucking nominated for a country award, and I think they won it, Trent Reznor's name was a part of the award. <laughs> Which, of course, Trent Reznor, for those who don't know, that's the singer of Nine Inch Nails. A very uh -huh. not country band. <laughs> can't say, I can't say nothing says country like, I want to fuck you like an animal. I want to feel you from the inside. You get me closer to God. <laughs> Those are a little too heavy for country. <laughs> that's why that's why people love Johnny Cash. He he's country, but damn it, he talks deep. He's more folk, I feel like, actually, you know what I think about it. Oh, yeah, never mind. I like folk. I don't mind folk. Like uh, I love um uh that singer Kaleo. Kaleo. Seems that way, way down we go, go. But he has other songs that are like fucking fantastic. Fuck you. Duck. What were you gonna look up again before you asked a question? Um. Ah! So, speaking of Lil Nas, um. He made a post, <clears throat> uh, and like a picture and everything that. He got implants, like, like boob implants. Hell yeah. <laughs> and, and they look freaking ridiculous. <laughs> and everyone is like, everyone on Twitter is like, I don't know if it's actually real, because they really look real. <laughs> or if I really... Yeah. But they, they genuinely kind of just... Jeez. Hey man, if you want titties, you got titties. Yeah, that's, that's true. He can, you know, he'll probably have some fun. I, I support it. I don't know. Imagine you woke up with titties. First thing you'd probably do with them is just poke them, like especially in the shower. Oh, I wonder what these. Do. <laughs> do a little bit of jumping, something like that. Hey, how you been, by the way? Uh, you don't have to get into, like, personal shit, but I know what's going on. Uh, I, I actually meant to text you if you were doing alright after everything. Who? You! Oh. What? Huh? <laughs> what's, what's going on? Are you on okay? Here? Is what I'm saying. Oh, yeah. Cause, cause, uh, you know, I won't get into here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I was actually gonna text you afterwards if I w if I remembered. I was gonna be like, hey, how you doing? You still breathing? I mean, if anything, the thing that killed me most was 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 the heat from Saturday. Oh god. The heat. <laughs> yeah. During the match. Oh I, yeah, I, I wasn't there. What 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 uh? 
What happened? So, I so Ultimo gave me his drop kick, okay. and for one, I, I didn't really like pr protect myself too much, so I kind of just took his boot straight to my face. <laughs> um, but that wasn't too bad. But then Brandon, you know, he does his like choking in the corner, mm -hmm. and like goddamn, he he was like actually choking me. Yeah, Brand, um, Brand's still a little snug. Yeah, like he was pressing down on my throat, and I was like, "Holy shit, I actually can't breathe." <laughs> uh, and so then like I was up, lighten up, you're killing me. <laughs> you're killing me. I'm dying. Um, and then like w during one of those spots, like he, they got me into the heel corner, and Brandon was giving me like shoulders, and then Alejandro backed him up, and then Vine just gives me a, a quick punch to my to my face, oh. and and he genuinely like hit me in the eye and now i have like a, a tiny tiny like black eye <laughs> one time wrestling vine um it was to it was towards the end of the match uh we he uh bought me in the nose i didn't realize i didn't notice though because I, I was full of adrenaline and then was it after the match i i'd like check my nose i'm like oh shit i'm bleeding <laughs> <laughs> and then and then and then brandon gave me a choke slam <laughs> oh which, damn it I, I wanted to choke slam to be my finisher. Has has Fuck. he even choke slammed anyone before? <laughs> uh yeah, he did. He choke slammed Chad. Okay, okay, cause cause I I was sitting there and he's just like choke slam and I'm like, huh? I'm gonna say, what now? Why are you calling spots, man? <laughs> <laughs> then again, I um, was it when we wrestled? I uh, he wasn't doing anything, and of course this is like this had to be like, it was the six man. Uh, with us. Yeah. So, so, it was that match. He wasn't really doing anything, and I'm just like, oh, God. And I'm like, all right, fuck it. Uh, hit me, or something. Because <laughs> I'm like, throw me down, or some shit. Like, that, there was yeah. the one where, like, we were locking up, he wasn't doing anything, so I just fight, punch me. Thud, down I went. So I was like, okay, that worked. Yeah. And then, uh, Vine told us an idea of what to do next time, but it was, uh, Wait, did I do what I was supposed to do? Hopefully. Um, but no, it was it was funny. I got nervous. Like, oh god, here we go. <laughs> this is it. Fuck. No, it was fun. I love I, lo I love working with Brandon. I just and yeah, can't or Place wrestling. And it'll bounce the beam to a new position. Good old times. Good old times. Book is as good as ours. I really wanted to be in that battle royal too. That, that sucked having to miss. I wanted to be in that match so bad. <laughs> I'm like, man. Oh, the, oh, the, oh, yeah, the all Japan. Yeah, I'm like, damn it, I want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was just in the um, uh, the six man that we had that night. Really? Oh, probably not enough tag guys. Yeah, no, we we ran out of people. I was thinking, you know, oh yeah, and refs, okay. Wait, did oh, you, or, I don't know. Oh, no. Uh, no, Alejandro refed it all. Oh, okay. damn, he's getting his fucking ref hours in, that poor bastard. Yeah, he's, you know, they're they're putting the trust in, in him. Yeah, he's doing good, so. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I told him that, too, like, dude, you are fucking, because I remember that one Iron Man match where, oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> That's when I gave him that camp come to Jesus meeting, and after that he was like, different dude. <laughs> I'm like, hell yeah. Hell yeah, that's what you want to see. And then, uh, oh fuck. Oh, okay, that worked. that's what I had to do. I thought, I thought I fucked up. <laughs> no, God, fuck. Ugh. <laughs> fucking, I hate, so like sometimes what happens is you can do the fucking jump mm -hmm. and uh, jump and hit the circle button and he hooks on to shit. Well, sometimes if there's something below him that you can hook on, like directly below the thing you're trying to hook on to, sometimes it'll fuck up and you'll like hook on to the thing below him, which is mm. not where you want to be <laughs> nine times out of ten. That's just not where you want to be. It's just, no, it's not where you, it's not where you want. We actually didn't have any uh, matches today either. We just did workouts, which just workouts. Yeah. <clears throat> well, there's only like four pe four active wrestlers. Uh, yeah. Today, so it's like uh, let's just work out. 
And then I fucking... I don't know what happened to me, but I did that fucking, um... The last drill I did was... The leg sweep, leg sweep drill. That one always just fucking kills me. Yeah. I mean, if I do it first thing, I'll be fine. But, like, yeah. this was towards the end of the night. And, uh... And it, I, it was it was all my fault. It, or all my fault. God, it's not that bad. It, it was my it was my bad, cause like you know it, I maybe I just, I didn't slow down. It also could have just been I'm tired. So then mm -hmm. we're trying to do the um, corner to corner drill. Uh, which that in itself is a lot. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a long one. I, I couldn't. I got lost. I kept getting lost. I was tired. I I got I suddenly felt sick. And then sure enough, I ran into the bathroom and eh, I don't know. Yeah. Ooh. Which I love, of course. I got shit for it. I'm like, what? I haven't done it in forever. It <laughs> happens. I, uh. If one, one of the training days, I'm, I can't remember if you were there. You, you might have been there. But I, you know, did the whole calling up downs while I was doing up downs. Yeah, I was there. And Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> yeah, because, like, now you're, like, blowing out air you're trying to keep. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I, I think it was the up-downs first to the, today that I think kind of set the tone for, I'm like, oh, boy, this is going to be a long day. Because, <laughs> like, for some reason, I think I, have a re I think I have an idea why I won't get into it in case anybody watches this and kicks my ass the next class. <laughs> but, uh, um, yeah, I... I, I think, uh, let's just say, uh, night before, uh, got a little bit of a party. <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna get it. Which I would... Personally, yeah. anytime that I take, like, even, like, two days off from doing, like, activity in general, yeah. I, I feel, like, utter, utter trash when I get back to it. Yeah, I, I, yeah, go. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm mad at myself in a way, but at the same time, I know I'll be fine tomorrow. So, I'm not yeah, gonna fucking lose sleep it's, that, like, day. it's that one day to like recover, get back into it. What was it you were talking about earlier? How like you had to pick up more hours. Um, yeah, I'm fucking. I'm gonna be missing Tuesdays now and just doing Wednesdays. Cause, uh, I had to pick up uh, some part-time hours at Great Clips. Mm -hmm. Probably till the spring. Gonna... Cause like my dad, getting... right now, uh, my dad right now, my dad right now, the season, the fucking, um, this is like the worst time of the year for business. So like, there's hardly yeah. any work. So pretty much, this is that's just to offset the uh, already have tons of money I owe <laughs> to people. <laughs> my dad included. Oh, gosh. And then, of course, birthday weekend, I have all the money. And I'm like, oh, I could just do this, that, and that. No. no. Strippers! Yay! <laughs> I, uh... I did pay my car payment, though, so you can't okay. get too mad. That's good. Speaking of car payments, I'm getting a new car at the end of the month. What kind? Do you know, or you just know you're getting a car? Um, more than likely, I'm looking at getting a, a Honda Elantra. Hmm. I don't know what that it's is. Like, I'm not a car guy. <laughs> it, well, well, it's. I'll have you know, it's a, it's a sedan. So. Mm, okay. So you gonna have automatic uh, start? M uh, maybe. I, I don't know. Apparently, I'm I missed the boat with my uh, Mitsubishi, because they're like, my dad found out I didn't have. My dad thought it already had automatic start. Mm-hmm. Because he, <laughs> it <laughs> one day, because like his car. So, my family's weird. He claims it was purely coincidence, but I don't know. Anytime anybody has whatever the newest car is, I, ha I f when I found out I had the newest car of the family, I knew either my dad or my grandpa were gonna get an we're gonna get a new car, like an up to date car. And sure as shit, my dad ended up getting like a 2018 fucking <laughs> car, which I love. He goes, uh. He, he goes, what? I didn't even want this car. I wanted this other car. <laughs> I forgot why he couldn't get it. But, and that was a 2016. <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. But I'm like, as soon as I found out, wait a minute, I have the newest car out of the entire family. That's not going to end well. 
<laughs> Someone's gonna be like, oh, I need a new car now. <laughs> I need a new car. Yeah, I think that it's, I'm getting a, it's a 2021. Um, really? Yes. And what? it's like, yeah, it's like 20, 19 or 20 K. Um, oh, that's not bad. So I'll be doing so I'll be doing like three thousand down, and then it's like depending on how many years I finance it for, it's like two fifty a month or like three hundred a month. Oh, I pay four hundred a month. Oh God, I'm so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Uh, do you have credit or like is this your first time? Did you have to get credit? Um, well, I have a credit card, so I have a credit score. Okay. And like, and I, I've made sure not to just go fucking insane with my credit card, so I have a pretty de good credit score. My dad is I, practically begging me to get a credit card to for like specifically like gas and shit, and I'm just like. <sighs> I mean, it's not a bad idea if it's you. It's not. It's good. It's a good idea. Especially, especially considering like, if you can take the time to like budget, considering you also get like. I mean, you get, like, cash back for using it. Yeah. So if you can, like, budget for knowing how much you are going to make and just using that amount, then, you know, you're going to build credit and you're going to get a tiny bit of money back. That and, I, that and like, fucking, I, knowing me, I would only use it for... I would only use it for, like, gas and shit. Like, nothing... Uh, oh, I'm gonna get this two thousand dollar plasma screen TV. Like, no. Yeah, man. <laughs> Fucking. Uh, I'm gonna just pretty much gas, cause especially going to uh, Woodstock from Belvedere, which I make it as if it's like, oh, it's so far. It's only like twenty miles, but you know. I mean, it adds up. Yeah, it does. I mean, for me, living in Elgin, it's a it's a solid like forty minute drive every time. I swear, Elgin 40. is just so far away from everything. <laughs> like, is it even close to Marengo? I don't think it is. Um, that's probably also like thirty minutes. Yeah. Oh, Barrington. Part of um, Barrington is probably also like thirty minutes. Oh my god. Schaumburg is thirty minutes. Yep. Yeah, um, that's what I thought. It's like in the middle of nowhere and like fucking far. So it is like a Chicago town. Well, depend. Well, it actually depends on which. It, it all depends on like what part of the city you're going to. Cause like if I go to Woodfield, it's thirty minutes. But if I go like to the edge of Schaumburg, it's it's only like twenty. Hmm. I remember. Um, I fucking found this uh, girl <clears throat> on uh, meet on Meet Me. I don't know if you ever heard of that. But uh, I have not. I'm gonna have to try it out now. No, don't. It's... Don't do it. You'll get fucking 900 fucking spam messaging you, telling them to enter your fucking meet me thing, blah, 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 that sort of deal. Anyway, um, met this girl. Hot girls in your area want to meet you. Yeah, pretty much. Met this girl, we're talking to her, and she goes, oh, uh, and she just casually throws out, hey, I don't have a place to stay. I, I'm currently homeless. Can you help me? And... Ooh. Me being the kind soul that I am, I let her come up. I paid for her fucking Uber. Uh, which, by the way, she's in, she's in like, St. Charles. So that's like $50 in Uber fees <laughs> to bring her up. So, she comes up. Uh, I, I leave her at the house because I had to go to work. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. She didn't yeah. steal anything, thank God, but it was it was hilarious, to say the least, because, so, here's the thing. What I didn't know was she's a fucking squatter, so what she does is, um, so what she does is she goes on dating sites, talks to random guys, and tries to get them, tries to get a place to stay. Uh, and nine times out of ten it, she'll do whatever it takes thankfully I'm not like that so I was like no you're fine uh, you can just stay here for a day or two and then she starts yeah. talking to my dad and my brother and she goes oh but oh I can stay for a little bit longer your dad said so I'm like yeah, no you're not I don't care <laughs> uh, I said uh, yeah cuz like after like first meeting here I knew this was a huge fucking mistake 
Uh, first of all, she smelled. She didn't sho she didn't shower. Um, she fucking God, what else? She yeah, she reeked. She fucking what? I'm trying to remember what else. The whole story. She she just didn't take care of herself, in a mm -hmm. way. So she also smelled like ah. Uh, We'll just straight up say vagina. Like, legit, you could smell it. Which, Jeez. yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's why I love when Anestra, when Anestra one week goes, where do you meet these people? <laughs> Talking to him <laughs> about fucking <laughs> past relationships. Yeah. Um, he goes, or, uh, so she, mind you, I'm being cool and everything. I'm like, hey, uh. I'm gonna go to work if you want. Uh, there's a towel right here. Go ahead, and take a shower. Uh, and a kind of a casual, way, hey, go, go, go ahead and shower. You know, that's cool. You can use my shower. Because I realized, like, just please take a shower. Because you so, so shower, do it. Smell like she smell like armpit. She smell like, like I said, puss. And then <laughs> finally, I had enough. And I'm like, all right, I'm taking you home. I'm taking you to wherever. She goes, okay, I got a place in Elgin with an ex. I'm like, okay, I'll take you right there. Drive her out there in Elgin, middle of nowhere, back roads, and I felt fucking creeped out the whole fucking time. Because, like, it's it's kind of unsettling. Where the fuck is this end of this laser pointer? Uh, the end of this laser pointer. So, I fucking just... Oh. She... <laughs> I drop her off. I notice she's wearing a pair of my underwear. <laughs> come to find out, I come back to the house. I see a pair of her underwear in my laundry and a huge shit stain. <laughs> she shat herself, threw it in my hamper <laughs> instead of, you know, throwing it away <laughs> and fucking steals my underwear. No, that's what you want. <laughs> oh my goodness. So then, okay, I think I finally know where to go. So then, I think like a week later, she texts me randomly, Hey, can you come pick me up and take me to Tinley Park uh, to pick up these hamsters that I want? And I'm just like, no. <laughs> I can't. No. So then, she then texts me going, Hey, I don't want to be here anymore, uh, because, oh, um, I, now I know where to go, fuck me. I don't want to be here anymore because I just googled my friend's name, which, who the fuck does that? One, and two, I found out he's a sex offender, and, and sends me all the info about him, and I'm just, look, I'm just thinking, I'm like, I, I what? <laughs> what? I'm like, you told I, me to take, you? you told me to take you there, and fucking... Again, why are you Googling your ex? Also, yeah. I think he's told me about it. She's told me about why that was why she broke up with him. So she's full of shit. Um, literally. Well, not anymore. It's in her underwear that she left in the hamper. Of course. <laughs> so I just, after that, I just cut contact with her. I, I kept text messages in case she tried to say I did something to her, but... Thankfully, uh, nothing came of that. <laughs> That's good. That's good. And then I learned, uh, no, we are no longer just taking in random ladies. We got the log chopping guide. Uh, well, I have not, um, had as many experiences as, as, you know, to, to go through that sort of thing. Yeah, I think, uh, that's a good thing. <laughs> yeah. We've had a... As of this point now, I've had a whole total of three relationships. Damn. Yes. I envy that, because I bet you they're My... more, uh, they're more, uh, what you would call it, fulfilling. <laughs> 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 Alright, never mind. <laughs> the first one was really nice. The second two... Uh, the second two... They both... They both lasted like two months and were just like. <laughs> this ain't working, fam. We're done. Yeah. The first one was nice, though. It, <gasps> it went for about a year, but then it was. It was kind of. It was it was a long distance, so it was just. Ah, like, uh, okay. I know what you yeah. mean. Yeah. But ultimately, it was like the. 
We would hop online and play video games, at, at, like, all the time. Oh, yeah. Was, like, yeah. Yeah, my, yeah, my longest relationships were long-distant ones. But, like, as in, like, they're in Chicago, and I can't oh, see them yeah. every day. Yeah, no, they lived in New York. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, I, um, that I don't know if I could do. I don't they know, maybe, did have, maybe as they a traveling visited. wrestler I could, but I'm not yeah. exactly traveling just yet. <laughs> they visited Chicago once. And I got to, we got to meet up one time, and that was, that, was a, that was a really fun time. We went to, like, Navy Pier and a few places in Chicago. We banged. It was awesome. No, no, no I didn't get that far. Oh, okay. Yeah. No. I, was, I was too much of a child for that. How old were you? I was 17. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I didn't have my first relationship till I was 17, man. I don't know, I kind of envy that, though, because, uh, I lost mine at, I, 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 I lost mine at 14, and it was terrible. I, I lost mine at 18. Honestly, I would've, because, uh, was it the next time, the next relationship where I actually, you know, did it, uh, I think I would've preferred yeah. that to be my first time, you know, the dude's a piece of shit, but, uh, at least yeah. that, that one didn't go bonkers crazy. That's fair. Well, I mean, it kind of did, but uh, not the <laughs> way after. Mm -hmm. But uh, fun stuff. Fun stuff you probably didn't need to know about me. So. <laughs> fun times. Fun times. So, yeah. yeah. Uh, my friends dubbed that incident with the squatter uh, shit britches. <laughs> oh my god. We talked about it on a podcast. It was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I still remember when <laughs> Zach goes, uh, did you tell Joe about shit britches? <laughs> I just look over at Joe in his fucking chair, holding his drink, and he's just mouth, shit britches. <laughs> he, he's like, what the fuck are they about to tell me? <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, so, that that second one I was, I was telling you about, yeah. um, I was doing wrestling at the time, but I don't, I don't think you'd had joined yet um she she showed up to a show like once and and sat on her phone the entire time oh. and then towards the like the tail end of the relationship like you know barely three months in she's like your wrestler your wrestling isn't important you don't get paid for it you should just quit fuck off <laughs> <laughs> and i was like bro what the fuck does she not have hobbies? Like, what the yeah, fuck? That, yeah, exactly. I was like, dude, it, 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 you know, at least at the lowest point, it's still like a hobby. People can enjoy hobbies. Yeah, it's a hobby where you kick your own ass. It's awesome. Yeah. Um, but after that, uh, uh, the whole, like, you should quit. There's no point in doing it. I was just like, I see ya. Yeah, this ain't gonna work. Uh, bye. I'd yeah, be the same I'm... way. I'm like, ah, no. You're not gonna no. just tell my childhood dream to go fuck itself. <laughs> yeah. Um, That's bull. Yeah, I would've dumped her too. That's bad. Yeah, I mean, n n there were some other reasons. Um, oh, yeah, by the sounds of it, she sounded like a real... <laughs> uh, yeah, at, at the time, like, it, it was like... The year that I graduated high school, um, but she was a senior at that point, so she was a year younger than me. Um, so she was gonna have her prom, right? And we were like, oh, I, I, I was like, yeah, you know, I, I, I suppose I could go. Um, <laughs> and then she's like, actually, I'm not gonna be able to go because they don't let um, like outside school people go to prom, which I, you know, I, I highly doubt that because so they do it literally all the time. Go. Yeah, um, and then, and then my friend texts me, and, and he's like, yeah, on her private Snapchat story, she's at the prom with another guy right now. And oh, like, ah. man. I'm Fuck like, ah. Off. That's I got, awful. I got a second reason. <laughs> yeah, you know, fuck you. You want to crush my dreams, and now you're fucking, you're fucking with other dudes? Get out of here. Fuck you. Yeah, that one, that one was probably the worst of all. Um, that's bad. Yeah. I'll just I'll just sit at home and play Minecraft every day. <laughs> that's that's uh that's what you want. 
Exactly. Minecraft's the best game ever. You can do anything in it. Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft. I was I was actually talking to Poncho the other day because I, I downloaded like the um. Yeah. Went wrong. I, guess. <laughs> <laughs> I I downloaded like uh you know how they have like Game Boy emulators on yeah. like, you, know, you can go on the phone. I got one so that I could play one of the Pokemon games. I think I got Red or something like that. Nice. And uh, I named my rival Poncho. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, he's like, you know, I actually did something like that last year. I was playing through one of the games. I think he was also playing through Red, and he's like, I named my rival Beard. Um, Aren't you two just meant for each other? <laughs> yeah, and he's, like, he, and he's like, do you remember that one camp where I was extremely quiet? And I was like, I might be able to point it out, I guess. I don't know. Um, and he's like, yeah, that time at camp that I was really quiet, Raichu died, and I was playing a Nuzlocke, so it, he's like, it was the best Pokemon on my team, but I had to give it up. <laughs> Poor Poncho. Losing his Pokemon. Wait, his Raichu died? What did you mean? So, people do like a, it's called a Nuzlocke to make Pokemon more difficult. Oh, okay. And so in a Nuzlocke, if your Pokemon faints... Um, you have to put it in the PC box and or release it and you can never use it again. Jesus. Yeah. And so, and so he was like, yeah, I was sitting at camp and, <laughs> and I was, I was super quiet because my, my Raichu died. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Pancho. <laughs> and, he, and he's like, and he's like, and you killed it because <laughs> I was his rival. Uh, it sucks to suck. <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't. He was picking on me about uh, sword. He was watching me fight. Um, what's her name? Oh, the fucking the gym leader. Y you know, <laughs> the gym leader. Fucking, she's old lady. Old lady. Yeah, he he told me he was making fun of you. Yeah, and then he goes, "Oh, it took me like four tries to." What the fuck? Oh, I, I, I walked out. I walked out. That that pair with that pair's reaction though. Um. Uh. Oh yeah, he's going. Oh, it took me like four four attempts to beat her. I'm like, and it took me one. I'm like, fuck you, my team. <laughs> he's making fun of my team. I'm like, well, at least I won once. I got there in the end. That's all that matters. Exactly. You know. Actually, I don't think I've uh, lost to a. Yeah, I don't think I've actually lost to a gym leader yet, which I'm sure that'll change soon. Cause, you know. Yeah, it happens at some point. Yeah, Pancho told me that. I'm like, oh god, here we go. It's fucking lady with the milk tank all over again. What are you typing? Don't worry about it. Okay. I, my mechanical keyboard... What happens between me and my mechanical keyboard is strictly between us. What are the odds of six fucking bears being asleep at, all at once? How have I only been streaming for an hour and a half? I feel like I've been here forever. <laughs> a good question. Um, but yeah, no, it's only 11.46. Wow. Here, be like two in the morning right now. <laughs> oh, what is this bullshit? Oh, okay. Let's see what I gotta do. Fucking hell, Sly, go. You kill me. The bills. Thank you. You know, Greg, ha have you ever heard of a website um called epal.gg? No. Oh. 
Well, I'll have you know, I'm a, I'm I'm a part of it. Oh yeah. What mm -hmm. is it? What's the website? Um, well, wh whenever I first joined, it was called eGirl.gg. Of course. Um, and and you could just you could pay eGirls to play video games with you. Um, and I thought that was like the most hilarious shit ever. It's genius um, too. <laughs> and th there were a few guys who were already on it, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna send in an application to become an e boy. An, an e boy. Um, and I I sent in. Th they ask for like what game you play, so that people can like search through games to find who they wanna oh, hire. Like category and shit. Yeah, and so I went on for like Minecraft and Overwatch. And they, <laughs> when you choose the game category, they ask for a screenshot of your abilities in the game, right? Okay. And, and I, it, I didn't even like, it wasn't even my stats. I legit took a screenshot of the character Mercy. I took a screenshot of her controls, like, and her abilities. And I used that in my application, and they accepted it. <laughs> awesome. Probably could have um, just sent them any fucking thing, and they would have been like, "Ding, good." That's probably fair. Or the guy that was there found it like hu very humorous <laughs> that that I took it literally and and sent him my abilities, um, because I play Mercy. Um, but regardless, um, ever since that day. My username on Blizzard is eBoy for Hire. <laughs> have you got have you gotten any? I actually have. Um That's awesome. but it's but it's been like months since I have. What's your rates? Um the lowest rate that you could do at the time was like a dollar for one game. And so I, I just did that. Okay, so you got like two bucks. Yeah. Where the fuck Good is this last bottle? Sorry. Good upset. times. Good, good, good times. Oh my god, I still have my jock strap on. Fuck. <laughs> my balls are suffocating, going, what are you doing? Oh no. <laughs> I <need air. laughs> oh my god. Okay, hold on. So, I'm gonna send you an image on Discord because I'm on my profile right now. This is this is the screenshot that I sent for my application. Okay. Yeah. No! There you go. Fuck it. <laughs> Clearly, her abilities. <laughs> and it worked. Fuck it. Yeah, it, I'm a genius. I'm a genius, he's Kanye. <laughs> I am the smartest man alive. But yeah, and then I've also, you know, I've, I've, you know, I, I had to, I, I hired some e-girls to play with me as well. And uh, that was a very enjoyable experience as well. Yeah. Um. <laughs> do, do you know the meme of like uh, Jordan Peele like sweating a lot? Yeah. <laughs> the first person that I like hired, I got their Discord, and then we got into like a voice call. And I spammed them with the gif of Jordan Peele so sweating a lot. And I was like, this is me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure they love you. I I am a ton of fun in the gaming community. The game community. <laughs> the game community. I am absolutely hilarious. Especially when I insult my teammates and you know call it the n-word you know it's... look i 
I... I thought you were about to justify I'm like, no, Justin! <laughs> okay, no, I... What I, you doing? I, I don't say that. Look, look all, all I'll say is... Um, I haven't said it over, like, the mic. I'll keep it to myself. But there have been numerous occasions where I call a teammate brain dead. You scared because the they fuck make out of me. me. I thought you were about to say... <laughs> No. I actually no, had I an incident the other day. I keep saying it because he's an idiot. Uh, fucking dude forgot to mute his mic. And he decided to call, like, his brother the N-word. On my fucking stream! Oh my god. <laughs> and for some reason, one of his friends clipped it. So I had to delete the clip before I got in trouble. And then I had to take down the fucking VOD. I said I was going to edit it and then put it back up, but I haven't. Cause like, no, every, every time I look at it, I just get pissed off, I'm like, fuck. Yeah. Um. I'll edit it when I put it on YouTube, for sure. Yeah. I'll have you know, the other day at work, um, at my second job, I work at a truck stop, right? Yeah. Oh, a truck and... stop, you're gonna hear a lot of horrible shit. Well, well, also, I think they're all just, like, maybe some of the dumbest okay, people so... I've met. Oh, yeah, you don't say, the truckers. Um. We had a pump that wasn't working, right? And and so so we put a traffic cone in front of the pump, completely blocking it so that you couldn't drive into it. And this guy comes in and he's like, "Hey, pump 18 isn't working." And we're like, "Hey, wait, isn't pump 18 the one that we put the traffic cone at?" And he's like, "Oh, I I didn't know that I wasn't supposed to move that." I've done that before cuz I'm an, I'm an idiot. I, th I thought I could use this one ATM. Uh, I <laughs> <laughs> so I just but, put a fucking traffic code and pulled up to it. And then suddenly oh I was my. missing $200 because it didn't it didn't give it, but it still registered that I took $200 out. Oh my god. It, it credited it back to me in like fucking 20 minutes, thank god. But yeah. I was, uh, I, I kind of had a mental breakdown. <laughs> but I mean, like... What what were you thinking when you saw the traffic cone blocking it and you were like, hey, you know. I figured it was like, I don't know, I because I, I can't even justify it. I know it's done. I even told the lady like, look, I know I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. <laughs> Start crying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry yeah, I kind of did. <laughs> I I mean I get emotional sometimes and especially when it comes to money. <laughs> and when it, and when it's my damn ass fault, I lost it. You know. It's one thing like missing an opportunity to make a lot of money. It's a one. It's a whole other thing to just lose money that you just had in your hand that yeah. you're about to pay bills with. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of people that come into that store that are, let's just, you know, kind kind of short. I mean, kind of short. Kind of short a few brain cells, I guess. Um, so, we have, like, an announcement that, like, the store requires masks. Okay, um, of course. But, but the management doesn't enforce it. Of course. <laughs> they, they, they don't care. Um, and there's, like, an announcement that goes off. It's like, yeah, attention customers, masks are required in the store. And, and it went off one time, and I was ringing out a customer, and, and he turns to me, and he's like, you know, I've had it with all this communist propaganda with oh these masks and God. stuff. <laughs> I'm like, ah, one of those I see. I had a uh, chimney job. Me and uh, my coworker were out to sweep this uh, lady's chimney. We pull mm -hmm. up. She's fucking house is fucking cluttered with shit. And, uh, she said, oh yeah, I'm a teacher, or some shit. I was like, oh, okay. Uh, I'm a teacher. I, I actually recently, um, left teaching, my teaching job, or some shit. And, uh, was it? she had to wear a mask, which is fine. I mean, I usually wear mine anyway, because usually when I work in the morning, I don't look pretty. <laughs> so, yeah. fucking... <laughs> she goes... I forgot what she said. So she had us clean it, give give her a fucking inspection because she was worried about it. Because five years prior, she was told something about something needing replaced or some shit. So she just so she didn't use her chimney for five years. 
So we looked up in there. There was no clean. There's nothing that needed to be cleaned because, you know, she hadn't used it in five years. Yes. Uh, after being told about something. I, I She she claims that, like, was it a, the back wall could get could heat up and crack the thing, which, yeah, that happens after a few, after, like, ten years, something like that. It happens, you know. But, um, she put this heat, heat shield in front of it and just never used it. So anyway, long story short, we finish up, and she goes, Oh, that's so glad to hear, because uh, uh, when the Russians uh, take out the power grid, I would like to be able to have a, at least a fire. And I'm just like, think, and I'm looking at her thinking she's joking, but she is dead ass serious. And just not joking. And it's funny, because... Uh, <laughs> My coworker said, dude, I had to do everything to not bust out laughing, because as soon as she said that, I looked at you, and your eyes went so wide. Because <laughs> I just said, did I just hear what I think I just heard? <laughs> fucking. I love a teacher. She's like, she's a fucking teacher. <laughs> she, can you imagine this paranoid bitch being your fucking teacher? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Since that job we pulled in Istanbul. It was awesome. <laughs> oh, gotta love it. It is it is the best. Fuck me. Where is there's like one clue bottle left. I can't fucking find it. Also I'm going to drown. Oh well, there you go. Uh -huh. I drown. What the fuck? He fucking turned upside down and his ass is in the air. <laughs> oh, Murray. Oh, my God. Hang on, Justin. Shh. Never mind. That's the thing about these clue bottles. You'll think you hear one when you really aren't. You're just paranoid and you're listening for things that aren't there. I swear I can hear it. No, you can't. Crack is an amazing drug. <clears throat> anyway. <clears throat> Alright, fuck this. I'm not using that ice pad. Oh yeah, you know, there's this bridge right here. I could've just walked across. <laughs> no, I had to be cool and be like, no, it's a platformer. <laughs> you know, Greg, I think you should become an e-girl. An e-girl? I keep For telling all my friends to make holy fans pages oh god <laughs> time to be <laughs> in the singlet for american beard only fans this you just post a picture you just post a picture of you in the singlet and you just said i'm not wearing any underwear right now but they wouldn't know because you're in a fucking singlet <laughs> <laughs> oh my god i bet you want to know what's underneath <laughs> you photoshop like uh you, you photoshop uh your you photoshop uh the beard's head onto like naked girls bodies and post it on the, um <laughs> our moose friend here is having trouble he's uh clipping through the oh he's oh. <laughs> through the floor uh yeah, he's fine probably maybe oh it's not a moose it's a it's a head it's it's a moose head oh, that okay. you're supposed to wear. Oh. Okay. Um. Completely off topic. Recently, I watched uh, I Over the Garden Wall. I hear that show's good. It it was extremely enjoyable. Um. I started watching Amphibia, and uh, I fucking love that show. <laughs> I'm loving they, it. So um, the the little kid has like a pet frog, right? Yeah. And and um, there's there's a scene where they're on a, a boat, and the they're with we're, they're with a talking bird, and the talking bird is like really down. You know, I'm setting the stage, um, and and the older brother is like, hey, what do you think is going on with with Beatrice? She seems kind of out of it, doesn't she? And the little kid's like. No, I'm more concerned with George Washington being naked. And it, and, it, and it cuts to the frog. And he's like, look at him. Look at his cold feet. He's so... 
All the other frogs are wearing clothes and he's not. <laughs> well. <laughs> or like they 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 went into a house that they thought was abandoned, but it really wasn't. And then someone opens the door and she's like, "Ah, who are you?" And the kids like, "We're burglars." <laughs> <laughs> it it has some of the some of the best comedy stuff. Oh. It is great. Yeah, my, my late night Discord adventures tend to just be like really weird YouTube expeditions with my friends or like watching TV and Netflix and Disney Plus and everything. It's not working. Oh, there it goes. Hmm? Hurry. Heads up. Did you know that elephants have like a thousand muscles in their trunk alone? Jesus. Did you know you can make paper out of elephant shit? The moose. The moose. Oh! Oh, I was completely wrong. Um, <laughs> an elephant trunk has 40,000 muscles in it. Which is which is more than the human body, which only has six hundred. Man, I wish my trunk had forty thousand muscles in it. Nothing like a very poor control tank battle. <laughs> Nothing tickles my nipple more. Alright, hold on. Hold on, what? <laughs> what? Why did they get fucking flamethrowers on their fucking tank? annoying all right I'm just gonna be sort of careful so I have a cat who's like really old and he's like senile almost I'd say um, and basically he just will he'll like stare at a wall and just meow very loudly that's like my kind of cat. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just, yeah. If you hear a loud meow, you'll know. I got animals too, man, so I get it. Yeah. Some of them have been vocal on stream. And then of course, whenever Zek shows up, he, he's got his bird in the background squawking. <laughs> he's got a macaw. Trying to get him to tell teach him to Just says peekaboo, that's it. Oh my god, Justin, this is the shits. Don't wanna play this fucking mini game. The worst mini game possible. Probably at least it's the Sly. No! There's been some worse mini games than Sly, but This one is just a bitch. A bitch. A bitch bitch. Wow, I, I really hate these controls. Yeah, me too. What are you playing? I'm playing a... <laughs> like, like a Flash game. Oh, for fuck's sake, just... Um... And... To, to scroll... To yeah. scroll through the weapons... 
you use the like the mouse, right? Mm -hmm. Um, and if you scroll up, it's fine because you're at the top of the page. But if I scroll down to choose my weapon, the page also scrolls down, mm. um, which is kind of a problem. Don't you love it? Yes. After reading through the log shopping guide, it's become painfully clear that to win in the lumberjack hey, games, we'll have you're an awesome star. Now I've constructed a Get plan game that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg. Which is more difficult than you'd think. Go play. First, Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, the pressurized oil should ignite and create upgrades, <laughs> which Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest. Grab an egg and then head back funny. to the safe house. Eagles. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC combat yeah, club, we've deal learned with that the deal with eagles. battery is get hidden in eggs. a silo nearby. No, the that's battery nice. needs some serious modification yeah, I don't think the Eagles are going to appreciate it. Decided to sneak onto Arpeggio's blip. First, we'll short the battery with grapple lines on local boats. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. Given my electrical engineering background, this plan has a 97% chance of success. Pretty good, huh? Hmm. 97% effective, huh? Huh, Bentley? Sound like a COVID vaccine. <laughs> My mom actually got that shot. She got her second dose yesterday. No, oh, nice. She says she felt like absolute shit when she got the first shot. She said the second shot wasn't as bad. Hmm. Yeah, I, I have not gotten mine yet. Not yet. I'm just gonna wait. Well, you kind of. There's not really much of a choice because they're only giving it to so many people. Yeah, I mean, I'm not against it. Um, I'm probably just not. It's probably just not like the top of my priority. <laughs> right. Where am I going? I ain't going out of the country. Yeah. So you want me to go in there and bust the thing up? Sounds like work for Murray. Actually, this job will require all three of our skills. Again, it's locked with a chair. It's not like lock lock. It's just a chair. It's just a chair. Murray could put put his fist through the door and it works. Oh, okay. How the fuck am I supposed to climb up on this thing? Click, 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 click. All right, buddy. Where you at? bottle Wee Ooh. Hey Now you can finally retire. I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> I don't got electrocuted. Ah, uh, god darn dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be right back and take adventure out into the other rooms. Adventure? Adventure in general. Oh, 
Well, now you can pick pocket all of a sudden. Put an elevator in this place. Oh, that's not gonna get annoying. Climbing Sly, we can't keep this thing reversed forever. This is heavier than it looks. I'm fucking trying. The hell? Oh, you bastard. Are you fucking kidding me? I can't go out the door? Okay. Yes, I went on an adventure to my kitchen. Oh, I thought your cat's name was Adventure. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta fight the urge to, to late night snack. No, I still gotta don't. put that fucking pizza in the fridge. I'm so sick of pizza. It's really all I have to eat. I'm just like, I don't want to eat this though. My 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 days have been pretty consistent lately. I got like um I've been getting like some some yogurt and stuff. On and. I would make so during like the time that I have time in the mornings. I usually make like French toast uh -huh. because I mean, it's 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 bread and eggs. Ooh. It's pretty pretty good. Yes. Um. But whenever I don't have time, I just make like grilled cheese, and that's still not bad. But you know, 
Uh, but I've been just like making sure that I hit like a certain amount of protein because mm. I'm trying to, I'm still trying to like lose some of my gut, uh, but I don't want to lose my muscle while I'm going down. So I'm making sure I'm just getting the protein. That's important. Oh my god, my lower back. I need to go, I need to get this pillow. Oh, my lower, my lower back. My lower back is dying. Oh fuck, why did I think that was a good idea? Okay, that video is going on my meme playlist on YouTube. I thoroughly enjoyed that. What is this? Oh, do lightning attack. Cool. Zooks, that's a nice one. Zoom, zoom. That's a nice one. Whoa. Alright, that works. Holy. Oh shit, yeah. <coughs> oh wow. 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 Ow, I'm dying. Oh no, the exit's over here. Stop whining. Stop whining! Big viner. See if I can hurt the bear. No, I cannot. Oh god. Whoops. Oh, something I hate when I happens. Fucking forgot my shoes for camp, so I fucking had to work out in my boots. So thankfully, by Ooh. this point, my boots are broken. Though they are also falling yeah. apart because they're cheap. <laughs> Oof. I gotta like super glue the fucking bottom. <laughs> Cause I don't yeah. yeah, they're cheap. I remember there was there was a guy, Tony, who who was the the big Russian guy that we had. Yeah. Um, I've heard stories uh, of said Russian man. He he got his boots and they were costume boots. Oh no. And he got them for like forty bucks and and Everyone was like, yeah, those are gonna break. And what do you know? His like first ever match on a show. First or second match on a show, and his boots break. Oh no. <laughs> and it's like, oh my goodness. He was like, yeah, I found a really good deal on these boots. They were only 40 bucks. And so Vine's checking him out, and he's like, Of course it's Vine. Anytime yeah, I wear my boots in camp, he stares at him. Yeah, and Vine's like, <laughs> Are, are you are you sure these are like actual boots? And he's like, he, yeah, I'm pretty sure. And he's like, what website did you get them on? I I don't know what the website was. And he's like, these are costume boots. <laughs> and yeah, didn't didn't go too well. Yeah, he told me. Uh, Ryan told me who to hit up. But like, uh, I don't have money yet, so I'm just gonna make these boots less. <laughs> yeah. So that old grizzle face will knock him apart? That's the idea. 
You might even try throwing fish at also, the I finally got a... Was it my mom got me a gym bag? So, like, a, like a carry-on bag. So, like, and I just keep yeah. all my wrestling gear in, in the fucking uh, gym bag, and then... Was it in the gym bag, and then, like, my uh, workout stuff in my backpack, so... It's a lot easier to carry than a big ass fucking um, suitcase for sure. <laughs> I just still use my backpack. It's hard to fit everything in the backpack. Though. That's yeah. That's why I wanted to make the switch because the bag with backpack was starting to get annoying. Yeah. Okay, he follows you. Oh, fuck. Go get him! Oh! How did the mission not fail? The bear died! Oh, there he is, he just respawned. <laughs> He fucking falls to his death. Yes. Oh, fuck off with all these flashlight guards. I figured he'd attack you. Maybe if he stood still, he'll attack you. But, like. Maybe. I'm not gonna test that theory out. You can just follow me, sir. Well, apparently, uh, the miners call him, the local miners call him Grizzle Face. <laughs> cool! Oh, you're killing me here. Oh my god! Okay, it exploded in my hand, so I thought, uh, the bear was gonna attack. <laughs> I knocked him out with- I, I took him out with the fish. I love it. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, I forgot I had the fucking fire punches. Probably should use that. There we go. God. Bentley! Where's the fish? I hear the squish squash, but, what, but no fish fash. Oh, here we go. Here he comes. Good. Yes, good bear. And of course there's bear traps. How the fuck am I supposed to get him down? It's gonna be like a path. Right? Hopefully. Ugh. Has, um, Art and Dave been back? Um, I saw them once, but other than that, that was like it. Art has my fucking ref shirt. That's why I he, ask. I think he has my pants. Oh yeah, that's right, he took your pants too. Yeah. <laughs> I think from now on it was, like, it was nice that he offered to wash my shit, but I'm like, uh, no, you don't, you don't uh, have to do that. Maybe, maybe if you're not going to be back for two weeks. I don't have anything to worry about. I'm not refing, but like, I like to have my ref shirt back. <laughs> Cause it's nice to have. Okay, that's what you have to do. Okay, just get rid of the bear traps. 
there, it's nice to have, especially in case, hey, I forgot my ref shirt. Oh, here you go. It's okay. Mm hmm And then after the end of the night, I just, all right, I'll just go wash it now. Are you fucking kidding me? He's not interested. How am I supposed to get him down? Oh, you know what? I think it doesn't matter where you're at. Hang on. He should follow the smell. How are we gonna get down? I don't know. I'd like to see. Where the fuck's the bear? Oh, here he comes. God, now that you mentioned Fairly Odd Parents earlier, I just have that um, elevator music stuck in my head. That's in Cosmo's head. <laughs> The parents fairly are parents. So the, 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 the crown pointy things. What? Large fries, chocolate shake. Um. I don't know the theme. <laughs> Sounds so defeated. <laughs> Well, I don't know the lyrics, I, I guess I'd say. Have you played this game and other ones before? Oh yeah, this is childhood right here. Childhood stuff, friend. Love Sly. Yoink. 